Well, today we are going to have a very soothing and relaxing evening. Because with us is Ghazal Maestro Pankaj Udhas. Pankaj Ji. Hi, Ruby. How are you? A Good very day. warm welcome to our Thank show. Thank you, Ruby. And it's so nice to have you here. In fact, it's such an honor and privilege. Thank you. You have done so much in the field of singing. And I think today we are going to have a real treat with your presence. I look forward, Ruby. As I was telling you earlier, it's a real treat for all of us music lovers here today. We have Mr. Pankaj Udhas with us. पंकज जी शुरू से शुरू करते हैं मुझे याद है आपका जो वो गीत था चिट्ठी आई है कितना सुनते थे इस गाने को दैट्स व्हाट ब्रॉट यू बैक टू इंडिया आई जस्ट कुडंट क्राई एनी मोर आई सेड आई हैव टू गो राइट बैक टू इंडिया यू हैव टू थैंक मी रियली यस आई आई डू थैंक यू आई डू इन फैक्ट आई वाज इन कनाडा एट द टाइम एंड ऑल ऑफ अस इंडियन फैमिलीज व्हेन वी गेट टुगेदर माय पेरेंट्स हैड टेप्ड दैट एंड वी टू सिट एंड वॉच इट एंड क्राई एंड क्राई एंड क्राई एंड रिमेंबर ऑल आवर लव्ड वंस No, I I I I remember uh singing this song in many many places all over. Yes. And uh I know of so many people who really come back to India because of that song. That's right. Yes. Because it finally made them realize the value of their family oh, yes. and Oh yes. Oh yes. Okay. And uh When you were recording this song, did you think it would have such an impact? It's, it's this song really has a uh, an amazing story behind it. In fact, I never wanted to sing this song. Oh, in what sense? Why? Because um uh when this film was being made uh i was considered for this particular song uh salim saab had written the story mm-hmm. salim saab salim of salim javed yes yes and then mahesh bhat saab was the director of the film and mm-hmm. rajendra kumar ji was the producer of the film they uh, all uh, felt that uh, this this song should be sung by a uh, real life singer and not an actor singer on the stage right because the the, situ- the situation is as you know that there is a live concert and there's a singer who's singing this song and that changes uh, there is this change of heart as far as sanjay dat is concerned and he comes back mm-hmm. so they they wanted a real real life singer uh, they wanted a singer who's popular who's known uh, by masses mm-hmm. <clears throat> so they had considered me as uh, the singer mm-hmm. but when rajendra kumar ji called me and told me that he wanted me to do this song he never told me this what he told me is this pankaj aapko hamari film mein kaam karna hai अच्छा एज अ हीरो एंड आई आई गेट स्केयर बिकॉज देन देन आई आस्क हिम सी सेड नो मेरी फिल्म में संजय दत्त है और मेरा बेटा है कुमार गौरव और आपको उस फिल्म में काम करना है सो आई गेट स्केयर बिकॉज आई 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 नेवर वाज कट आउट टू बी एन एक्टर इन द फर्स्ट प्लेस एंड आई नेवर वांटेड टू बी एन एक्टर ओके आई माय माय फोकस हैज ऑलवेज बीन सिंगिंग सो आई आई टोल्ड राजन कुमार जी आई सेड आई विल कम बैक टू यू एंड देन आई डिडंट कॉल हिम बैक एंड ही रियली गॉट मैड then he called my eldest brother mm-hmm. uh, manoj ji ji and manoj ji and rajendra kumar ji were best of friends ji so he called manoj ji and he was very angry and he said your brother has no etiquette he has no courtesy <laughs> koi tamiz nahi hai <laughs> and you know he's not even written my call and things like that so manoj ji in turn called me and he asked me said pankaj what what's what's the problem mm. so i said i i cannot sing you know I act in movies and i said i'm i'm, I'm not open to something like this oh. so my brother said in case if you don't want to act in the film just call up rajendra kumar ji and say that you don't want to act in the film yes so i picked up the phone i called him up and i said that my apologies i didn't call because i was scared because i don't want to act in the film right so he says who's asking you to act in the film he says <laughs> we are asking you to appear as pankaj udas oh and that's and oh that's how it all started and it would have been somebody else yes i know and then then no doubt after which when we recorded the song mm-hmm. i i guess i was destined to sing this song and mm-hmm. this is how it it happened so as as you as you asked me earlier when when we were in the studio when i finished uh, recording the song and there was a big crowd there you know lakshmi gant pyar lal who was the composer of the song anand mm-hmm. bakshi was the writer the mm-hmm. lyricist and then the whole uh, uh, lot of uh, Uh, technical people and plus uh, mahesh kumar mahesh bhat ji and uh, the rest of the people and i could feel that there was a definite uh, feeling of uh, you know sort of uh, that that you know that feeling which you have for your for your nation for your people for your family for your home yes. which is very very prominent out there and i think when we left the studio i think everyone was quite convinced that this song has a lot to say and later on it was david davan who was editing uh, who was the editor at then and he was editing the film mm-hmm. so in fact david uh, uh, turned around and told everyone because i remember going to the uh, to rajendra kumar ji's studio editing studio and seeing the film on a small monitor the oh, the song okay and that was the time we all felt that yes this song positively had uh, some some amazing 
future, you know, in terms of its its. Yes. Uh, it's, uh, a, it's a very different type yes. of song. I mean, it's not yes. the usual filmy kind of romantic. I mean, but it has. A, really, I, I personally feel that such songs actually. Uh, 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 again, I would say it's some kind of a coincidence because mm -hmm. when I started uh, singing, I started singing pretty early from my childhood. And uh, I remember that the first time I ever went on stage, I uh, the first song which I ever sang in front of a large audience of the public was uh, Ay Mere Vatan Ke Logo. Yes, yes, and it had an and overwhelming response. Tremendous. And when I look back and when I think of Chitthi Aai Hai, it's just a coincidence that after many, many years, I also sort of sang a song which evokes the same kind of oh, emotions yes. or the feelings or that's whatever right. you call it. And that's, that's where I feel that such songs cannot be created. Uh, they probably just happen. They just happen. And uh, that's it. I mean, you, you just cannot really sit down and figure it out as to, you want to create a song like that. Right. And um, so, of course, our viewers are just dying to hear two lines from you live here on Lehre. That same old song, but zyada nahi nahi to mero padungi phir se. No, I'm okay because you you should, you you're fine now. You're back in India. And but my parents are in Canada. Okay, I, I guess so yeah. That, that, yeah, that's that's I'm what going, makes It's going to be reverse uh, crying for me. <laughs> I, I can imagine. Oh gosh. Right, I'll sing a couple of lines in. Mm -hmm. Bade dino ke baad. हम बेवतनों को याद बड़े दिनों के बाद हम बेवतनों को याद वतन की मिट्टी आई है चिट्ठी आई है आई है चिट्ठी आई है चिट्ठी आई है वतन से चिट्ठी आई है Another song very fondly remembered, yes. a film with very be beautiful music, yes. is Sajan. Oh yes. And Jee To Jee Kaise. That was that was a beautiful song. I guess uh, again in Sajan, I I, I personally feel that uh, uh, what happens that uh, as as I was telling you earlier that after Nam I was approached by a whole lot of people, mm -hmm. and I guess it happens in in any commercial field that I was approached by people to do roles as, as a hero and all that. So I <laughs> said, thank you very much. They said, no, you, you've had such great success with Chitti Aai Hai. Yes. So I said, that is the song which is successful. But not, you acted uh, very well in that. I mean, you were I guess natural. it was spontaneous because I was singing. Right. I was not acting because, you know, right. Mahesh Bhatt was, was a great help. Mahesh Ji kept on telling me, he says, Pankaj, be yourself. Mm -hmm. Don't act. Mm -hmm. So And Saroj Khan was, you know, our uh, sort of, uh, she was the dance director, but she was actually doing the movements. Yes. And Sarojji also kept on telling me, she said, Pankaj, you do what you like. Don't go into any, you know, exaggerated uh, gestures and things like that. Mm -hmm. So I think that's why it turned out to be something which I do all the time. So, so much, uh, you know, happened after Naam and then I kept on refusing offers. I said, no, I don't want to be a hero. I don't want to be an actor. Mm -hmm. I want to stick to my singing. Mm -hmm. And it is around that time that uh, Lawrence D'Souza approached me and uh, he had this beautiful subject, which was a subject of a poet, actually, Sajan, mm -hmm. where, you know, Sa Sanjay Dutt is a poet and Madhuri Dikshit is a fan of this poet. Sanjay Dutt, again, he's been lucky for you. <laughs> yes, yes, and it's vice versa, maybe. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I like that sense of humor. Yes, that's true, actually. Yeah, maybe, yes. It's a good combination. Win-win <laughs> <Yes>. situation. <laughs> so, um, I, um, when I heard the story, I was very impressed. And mm. uh, then the, sit the situation was really wonderful, you know, whereby it's really like sort of a, a deciding kind of a situation in the film between uh, Salman, Sanjay, and Madhuri. This is a love triangle. Mm -hmm. And it, it is, uh, I, I heard the song because Shravan uh, played the song to me and I liked the song very much. It was, mm -hmm. it was very beautiful. So I did the song and uh, well, even that song, uh, uh, even today, uh, like these are the two songs like Chitti Aai Hai and Jiya To Jiya Kaise. Even if I'm doing a, an out and out ghazal concert, you know, amongst the uh, ghazal concerts, yes. I still have to sing these two songs. Yes, and you still have to sing for us also. <laughs> 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 जिए तो जिए कैसे बिन आपके जिए तो जिए कैसे बिन आपके लगता नहीं दिल कहीं 
बिन आपके जिए तो जिए कैसे बिन आपके